some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Martin County, Florida, where a Sovtard ends up running a red light because, well, he's not driving in the commercial capacity. So then common sense and the traffic laws don't apply to him because of that logic. Oh boy, that kind of moron. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Hello, how are you? Good, how are you doing? I'm good, thank what you. What is the purpose for you pulling me over? The there? purpose for me pulling you over is because you ran through that red light. Oh, I did? You did, yes sir. It wasn't yellow? No sir, it was solid red. No, it was. Yes. Have your license insurance no, actually, uh, we're not going to do that, so... Uh, I'm sorry? I don't know how to explain this to you, but I don't need to give you any identification. Okay. Yeah, you might want to check the uh, Florida laws on that, because, well, if you actually read them, you'll find that you are not exactly correct on that, so you really need to stop uh, drinking the Sovtard Kool-Aid and uh, get your head out of your ass and understand how the world really works. Yes, you do. I am no, requesting for your driver's license. No. Okay. So we're not doing this. Okay. No. I'm requesting for your driver's license. For what? What crime was committed? Because I'm conducting a traffic enforcement. What crime was committed, though? You broke a traffic enforcement. You ran through a red light. No. That's for a CDL driver. I don't know. I'm sorry? Oh, red lights are only for those driving a commercial vehicle? Uh, no, that's not how that works, because that would be utter chaos if everybody who had a regular Class E driver's license in the state of Florida suddenly started ignoring the red lights. Then everybody would start getting into wrecks. There would be more fatalities on the roadway if we started doing that. Gee, you're not too bright, are you? You didn't think of that kind of thing when you tried to put cobble together this pathetic little argument of yours? I mean, come on now, dude. Do better. Okay, go ahead and step out for me. I'm not stepping out of the vehicle. Go ahead and step out for me. That's not happening. That's not happening. All right, sir. That's not happening. Take your f***ing hands off of me. Step out for me. I'm not stepping out. I got a f***ing dog here, too. Call for backup, bro. Take my backup up. All right, step out. I'm not getting out. You're not telling me what I'm doing. Sir, we're not you, doing this. No, we, you damn straight okay. we're not. We're not doing this. Get your step hands out. off of me. Step get out. Get your hands off of I'm me. I'm telling you one more time. Step the but, f*** out. Who do you think step you are? Step out. Don't do that with the dog here. Okay, then don't do this. Don't do it. Don't do this. Don't do it with the dog step here. Step out. Don't do it with the dog here. Step out. What are you doing? Get the I have a dog out here. of the car. Get the f*** out of the car. Get the f*** out of the car. What are you doing? Get the f out of the car. Get the f out of the car. Get your hands on the ground. Get your hands on the Roll over here. Roll over to the other you side. You made a big mistake, buddy. Yeah, that's fine. I can't believe that. I can't believe you just punched me in the face. You're 100% right I did. You pushed my hand off the freaking... Stand up. Stand up. Stand up. Stand up. Stand up. You want to try and get the dog back in the car? Come over. Hey. Hey. Hold up. Hey, come here. Come on. Come on. Load up. Load up. Come on. Come on. Come on. Load up. Load up. Have a seat. Let me see about this. Done now. Went through a solid red light. He's like, 
I don't know why you stopped me. Explained to him why I stopped him. Asked him for his driver's license. He's like, I don't have to give you my driver's license. Let's only proceed to yell. And then I told him to step out. He's not stepping out. I told him several times. He's still not stepping out. Went to lock his door. He's like, and then that's when I grabbed his hands. Yeah, so I, and then I reach in. I go to try and open the door from the inside. He pushes my hands off. So he's stopped. David, yeah. listen to me. I'm I am giving you one opportunity to take care of your dog. Who can we call to get that dog? Uh, let, me, let me tell you something. Okay. I come from Massachusetts. That's fine. I've been down here for two years. Okay. I'm living inside my car. Okay. Okay. My girl and my baby live in another state. And I'm paying for their rent and all their other shit. Okay? okay. So I do not have anyone that I can call right now offhand. They can come get the dog. Okay. Actually, maybe I can call someone from work. We're I work gonna, at ABC over there. Well, we're going to call Animal mm -hmm. Control. Okay. Well, let me go. call. Let me, can I call someone from work then? How fast can they get here? I don't, they live down the street. Down the street? Yeah. Okay. Your phone in the car? Yep. Okay. I believe so. Hold on a sec. Uh, Sarge said we just take good pictures of him. Okay. I guess when he gets to the jail or whatever. What's his major malfunction? Why did you do all that? He just said he it's doesn't have a okay, so, Well, unfortunately we're in Florida and that doesn't pass here, so... Well, well, officer, it wouldn't work in Massachusetts either, but this guy thinks he's above the law because he drank all that soft, hard, lead-laced Kool-Aid that the gurus uh, pass out at the seminars that tend to melt these guys' brains to the point where they can't think for themselves anymore and they just want to do what the soft, hard guru says. I'm going to write you a supplement for my use of force and stuff like that. Um... Other than that, you should be good, right? Yeah. Uh, we're calling animal control for the dog and... See if we can call him right. Okay. And then we're... Yeah, if you don't mind. That dog will bit me when I walk around. It ain't more. And fine, we'll just call animal control. Yeah, we're going to call animal control He has that, like, axe right there. I was like, oh, there you he had go. He's got an axe in there? Right there. Right by the passenger. Or a hammer. Something. Yeah, I just saw one of yeah, my. Thank God he didn't grab that hammer. Yeah, he had two he hammers. Got and shot. He had a knife too, and then. Yeah, he went his head blown off. So this guy started fighting with you. So what's the deal with uh, animal control? Because the dog's a little bit aggressive. Oh no, no, I'm saying, are they like? They're ten eight. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, you can turn that off now. We're just waiting for right. animal control and stuff. Okay. I'm gonna read you your rights, okay? You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in the court of law. You have the. Do you understand the rights I have read to you? Yes, no, maybe. Sir. No. Or do you not want to speak? I don't answer any questions. Okay. What you need? Well, they all stupid is as stupid does. This softard had very weak arguments and, uh, well, just could not back them up whatsoever. And was charged with the usual softard BS of having no license, no registration, no proof of insurance, and everything like that.
I mean, when will these idiots learn that you can't get away with that kind of thing? I mean, in no insurance especially. I mean, what happens if you hit somebody and you're not able to pay for any of it? I mean, come on now, dude. You got to think about these things. So at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. And I will see you on the next one. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?